Okay guys, welcome to another game review. Doing this specially for uh, my thousand views. This is Oregon Trail. <laughs> so, as a kid, I used to love playing Oregon Trail. So when I saw this was on sale, I thought I'd you know, try it out since it was only two bucks. And it's not bad, I haven't played it that much, but I thought I'd show it off a little bit. So, I'm a scared little cat, so I'm going to use Play Easy. And we're going to skip the intro because I've already seen it. Who is the party leader? My, I am, of course. My name's not actually Stu. Okay, it's Stuart. Jeez. Okay, okay. These names are not my friends' names either. They are similar, except for Bill. I got that from Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridged. Alright, so after playing this game once, I feel that ammo is not quite as necessary as I thought it was. Food is pretty important. Fuel is definitely important. The more med kits, the better. In fact, we need more money. We need that, that, that. Alright, let's try that out. We'll see how that goes. I'm just going to play through for a little bit. So you start out 230 miles to Pittsburgh. That's your... You originally started in Washington, but a little bit farther away from Washington, D.C. with the intro and stuff, but I changed it. A, since I skipped the intro, you're actually going to Pittsburgh first. So if I stop here, I can... I can kill anybody in my group if I want to. The first time I played through, my sister uh, was playing with a tire, and it broke, and so I shot her. And it was, it was a very sad day. So I'm actually going to set my pace to normal. You can get car upgrades in cities. Uh, here's the road map. As you can see, you kind of pace around. And you can repair. These are your supplies. You can trade, ration. I'm actually going to do medium. And do I have any combat training to do? There's no combat training to be done. You can learn that in cities as well. Okay, so we're going to start moving again. As you can see, the health down there. It's not very uh, pretty looking, but... You know, that's the idea. It's supposed to be like the original Oregon Trail. Although, if you ask me, better graphics is something that should be considered. Although I don't mind this, you know, I prefer better graphics. But whatever, that's just semantics. Okay, so I can buy an upgrade here. A V6 engine, travel faster at the expense of the car. Which I don't really want, so I'm going to hold off on that. Now you can take jobs in each city. And it'll tell you how difficult they are. So I'm going to do both of these. This one's defense. Uh, there's different jobs every time. But as you can see, this one's just sh shoot the zombies. And sometimes they won't die instantly. I'm very bad at shooting the zombies. As you can see here, I'm failing miserably. Good. Oh man, <laughs> did not even see that zombie sneaking up on me, so I failed the mission. Now this one is, uh, I didn't actually read, but, oh, this one's where you try and evade the zombies as best you can and get to the end, and you get like a little crate. It's a really simple job, but it, you know, adds a little something extra to the game. It's not bad. So I'm just gonna walk. I'm too lazy to kill zombies. Later on there gets to be like a shit ton of them, and it's pretty scary. Oh shoot! Oh fuck. I did not mean to do that, but usually I'm okay doing that stuff. Uh, well, let's see. Let's use a med kit. Two med kits on me. And I think I think we're good to go. Yeah, let's go. Alright, continuing on. Let's cross a horde of zombies. Okay, so It'll tell you the size and it'll tell you the disposition of the horde, so you can do certain things. Um, I'm gonna see if it disperses. So you wait an hour, and nothing has changed. So I'm gonna attempt to sneak through. Maybe I get lucky here. We'll see. Uh, casually just driving through a horde of zombies. It's all good. All right, we made it through. Okay, 200 miles to something. I didn't actually see. 
it's got some pretty good music, you know, all pixely and whatnot. It, it's very well done. I like the game a lot. You stop suddenly to avoid hitting a zombie and everyone gets whiplash. No, not whiplash! Uh, I like how you can get... When they're telling you about the game, they're like, You can get dysentery and eight other diseases. Specifically pointing that one out as people would get it all the time in Oregon Trail. It was like the main disease to get. At least that's how I remember it. Think see, you think you see something going on in the distance. Will you get out to... Him? No, that is a horrible idea. Never get out of the car in a zombie apocalypse. Seriously. Bad idea. The road is impassable. Finding an array. Ugh. Jeez. <sighs> I'm just suffering lots of troubles. Nothing goes my way. Alright, so we're at the mall. Left to die. Haha. Uh -huh. So I can get to the combat trainer. Chance to not use a bullet when you fire. Oh, okay. Is that worth it though? See, some of the stuff I don't feel like is worth it, really. Maybe I'm wrong, but uh, it's not something I particularly want. So we're just going to keep on moving, because we're alright. You can get a lot more in-depth into this game if you want to. Like, really figure out all the fanatics and stuff, which is, you know, fun for some people. For me, it's more about just try and get to the end as best as you can. <laughs> Usually doesn't go over well. Oh, we're getting close to a city. A gas can fell off the car and- Are oh, you fucking kidding me? I'm just not having good luck with my fuel. Probably because I brought so much. You suddenly find yourself sur oh. Seriously. I'm having terrible luck. Yeah, headshot. That was a bad shot. I wonder if like on hardcore mode, if, if you screw up here, you're dead. That'd be so mean. Most likely it's just a lot harder to kill all the zombies. Shit. Shit. Die. Die. Damn it. Damn it. No. No. Shit. Running out of ammo. Fuck. Whew, that was close. Alright. I was kind of a little bit close there. Uh, it was just to keep things exciting. I definitely had it under control. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Alright, so we've made it to Indianapolis. Finally. Let's see what our upgrade is. Solar panel. Move slowly while out of fuel. I like that. I will actually take that. So now, if I go to my car and I go to upgrades... As you can see, it actually changes the look of your car. I doubt it actually changes it uh, on the map, but that's kind of cool that, it, that you can have different things. I think that's pretty cool. So let's try and repair it. We have 10 scrap. 20% chance. The more scrap you use, the more likely it will happen. Will I get lucky? Oh, repairs failed. Damn. Let's try again. Once more. I believe... Come on! Damn it! Alright. Screw it. I'm done. 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 Leaving. Forget you, Indianapolis. The rumbling sound comes from behind you. Oh. Alright. So, this one is like. Zombie deer? What the fuck? Oh god! Oh god! Oh, frick! Okay, so you have to avoid the deer, you're not trying to hit them. There's a similar game where you have to try and run over the motorcyclers chasing you. So I've nearly died here because I didn't understand what was going on. So this is apparently a boss fight. Zombie deer! Ha <laughs> ha, that's hilarious. Oh my god! Alright, alright, it's okay, it's okay, we escaped the zombie deer of all things, that's hilarious. But now my station wagon is fixing to break, which is just, just dead. And now it's broken. Alright, let's try and repair it. Let's use all the scrap we have. Only gets us a 70% chance of success, unfortunately. What are you gonna do? Come on. Dude! Now what am I supposed to do? Okay, uh... Supply, trade... 
or they're scra yes I'll take that yes I'll do that as well okay so now I should be able to repair my car I'm taking no chances I'm 88% chance there's no way I can fail come on come on okay all good guys next time we're in the store we're gonna have to buy a lot of scrap that is something that I really didn't think about you need a lot of scrap because your car breaks down really easily spend some time cleaning guts out apparently there are guts in my car I, I don't know why so we continue along our way to Joe has exhaustion that's just dandy of course he has exhaustion you know what you know what <sighs> medkit and we'll rest we'll rest for four hours okay he is no longer does he have exhaustion so we can finally move on thank god Brit. Bill has a broken arm and we've made it to the farmland reload in half the time now that is something I want unfortunately I don't have the money so let's see I can do this alright so this is that same mission I was showing you earlier but I failed this time I'm going to succeed because I believe just avoid the zombies some of them are kind of fat some have no legs yeah blood is pink in this game guys uh, I don't know why maybe it just looks better against the black screen probably is what it is so many zombies why what happened oh shit Ow. Ah, ah, so close. You see that crate at the end? That's what I needed to get. You know, I didn't use, never failed it once earlier, but now I'm failed. Okay, uh, let's sell some of our ammo, actually. Get some money, and let's sell a little bit of our fuel. And I want to buy some scrap. Oh, apparently he doesn't have any. Only has one. Only had one scrap to sell. That's unfortunate. Oh, and now I'm getting attacked by a biker gang. Yeah, shit, shit, a lot of shit happens in this game. Just saying, that biker game was off. Okay, that biker game was awfully large and very stupid. They kept coming up right behind me as if to not crash into the back of me. Anyway, 160 miles to Chicago. So by the time we get to Chicago, I'm probably gonna end it once we get there. Okay. Car broken down cars. Uh, so much shit happens in a zombie apocalypse. What is up with this? This seems more likely than certain other things, I guess. Alright, we've almost made it to Chicago. Bill's about to die. That's okay, though. Chicago! Auto shop. Buy upgrade. Fog lights. No slowdown and heavy fog. So I can actually repair my car and it just costs money. It costs 29 just to do that. Just to... Uh, click it on the wrong button. There we go. Okay, so I repaired my car a bit. Uh, now... <laughs> 106, 96 miles to remote check, but that's okay. I'm gonna stop here, guys. Uh, you get the gist of the game. Bill has become incap, inca, incapacitated. Is that how you spell it? There's a tombstone. No, I don't want to look at the tombstone. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. We're gonna end this in the best way possible. We're gonna put him out of his misery. It had to be done. They all have to die. Oh, it's such a shame. Oh, knee shot.
Uh, uh, just, uh, I'm not trying to hit you or anything. No, no, no. Okay, there we go. And finally, Austina. I'm sorry, Austina. Uh, <laughs> they all had to die. Anyway, thanks for watching. Tune in next next week. No, there will be no next week. Thanks for watching this game review of. Uh,